but speaking of the holidays, um, just everyday life in general, another thing that tends to take a lot of time and sometimes can be stressful is cooking. But what if there was a way to take your own portable oven with you anywhere that you went? So if you have a plug, you could warm, you could reheat, but you could also cook your food from raw right inside of this little guy. You'll never burn it, you'll never overheat it, and you can use any flat bottom. So it could be a cardboard box from the freezer aisle, it could be your glass container, your Tupperware, does not matter. And what I love is you could do it at your cubicle, you could be on a campsite, you could be in your car. If you have a power source, you're gonna cook with this. It's called the Hot Logic Mini Personal Portable Oven. Out of 87 reviews, 71 of them are perfect five stars. That says a lot and the price point is amazing today when you're picking this up just choose your color we have black blue green orange pink or purple for you and you're going to get this home and be well on your way to cooking what feels like something mark you spent hours doing absolutely it did the work for you it did all, all the i work had to do you. was plug it in hi mark welcome How are to lunch you? rush <laughs> i'm great excellent now listen i know that you've seen ooey gooey cheesy steamy hot beautiful baked ziti before, but what you've never done is cook it at your desk or in your car or at the office or in the classroom yeah. <laughs> or anywhere because what the, what the Hot Logic Mini is, and you nailed it, is a personal portable oven. So anywhere you yeah. have a plug, anywhere you have a 12 volt thing in the car, you can actually not only warm and reheat, but cook. In fact, watch how simple this is, okay? okay. Right. Here's what we've done. We've taken a factory set exclusive 165 degree induction plate and place it inside of our insulated tote. Now that 165 degrees matters. That's the difference between heating and warming mm -hmm. and actually cooking. So the dish that you just saw me prepare, okay. watch how simple this is. Now, if you have a, a meal schedule, sometimes maybe it's lunch or dinner, whatever it is you do, that isn't defined by a clock, then you know that meals can get boring because you're making the same thing every day, yeah. or they get expensive because you're eating out, or you're waiting in line at that silly microwave that Ugh. nobody cleans, right? There's <laughs> food everywhere, and you don't even wanna know what a microwave will do to your food. So in the same amount of time that it takes to make a peanut butter and jelly sandwich in the morning, go ahead, pop the top on, because all you need is anything with a flat bottom. Could be glass, could be tin, makes no difference. And hiding in the back is your outlet. In one to two hours, this will be cooked. If it was frozen, and we'll get to that in a second, yeah. two to four hours, it will never overcook it. And just in case things run a little late, it'll hold that temperature for and you and never dry it out. That's the beauty of this. Say you get to work and plug <laughs> it in in your cubicle and lunch passes you by, you can eat it anytime. It, now this is showing what's happening inside, right? What happens is that exclusive induction plate reacts with the bottom of that a uh, vessel that you use, whether it's glass or tin or foil or paper, makes no difference at all. Okay. That's what's gonna slowly and gently heat that food. But remember, 165 degrees. That means you're cooking. And not just cooking, but you can also cook from frozen. And I need the Uber driver to think about this, and the Lyft driver, and the teacher. This is a bag uh, of college frozen student. college students. Guys, this is frozen grandma's stew. It really is. And I just made a huge mistake. Everybody at the office <laughs> hey, in Michigan right moment. now Learning is moment. laughing at me. Me because I didn't put it in the glass <laughs> tin. Listen, yes. nobody's perfect. You wouldn't put your food right on <laughs> oh the stove Oh my goodness, the guy top, that writes right? my check just watch this. So Don't if that ever it. happens, there you go. And then all you're gonna do is you're gonna stick that inside. Now for fresh beef stew, watch this. Frozen veggies, okay. frozen meat, a little bit of brown gravy on top, and you've got all the ingredients you need for that perfect stew. Now, whether yeah. you're camping at the office, whether you're a teacher, whether you're a doctor, whether you're a lawyer, you're gonna get to the office, or even in the car, you're gonna plug that in, and I want you to watch this. Okay. And if you're going to potlucks this year, or you're bringing some food over to people's houses, watch this, this is absolutely gorgeous. Steamy, hot, and that beef Look at that. is cooked. So you're talking two to four hours for frozen, and then when it's done, Michelle, this will actually hold that food at the perfect 165 degrees until you and your family are yeah. ready to eat it, not when it tells you. And to me, that is just the coolest thing about Hot Logic. And look, you get a little a quick like guidebook, and it gives you ideas as well. And then let's take a second then mm -hmm. and talk about the dishes that you are using inside. Absolutely. What size is this? Have and a look what over here. Work? Nine by seven is your standard kind of glass dish size. Anything below that is fine, as long as it has a flat bottom. It could be glass, 
It could be metal. It could be the plastic in your plastic wear. It could be the tin. It makes no difference at all as long as that bottom's flat. And just to prove the point, join me over here again. To me, this is one of the coolest things. Okay. It really is. I love this. If you are one of these people that every now and then you grab one of these free packaged mm -hmm. ones, and who doesn't? The freezers are full of them. You know we do it. Watch this. It's one thing to put it in the microwave and have the corners turn into some sort of rippled, congealed, steamy hot mess while the middle is soaked, or I mean it's cold. But watch this. These are actually so fantastic right. when they're heated up properly. So you've got a good tasting, good looking, thoroughly heated meal that you didn't have to stand in line for the microwave for. Right. You didn't have to fight anybody for space over. And the bottom line is it was ready when you're when you ready. Are. And you know, when you microwave too, a lot of times you're right, the stuff gets dry, it gets too hard. I mean, I like that you can just set it in there and not worry about it. So when you're ready to eat it, now you've got a delicious meal. Tell me you cooked this from now, raw. You gotta see this. That's This thin. is exactly from raw. You can plate this or you can eat it right in the container, but I do want you to see this. This is salmon cooked from raw with the noodles around it. And look at how tender and moist that fish that is. Look, it's amazing. falling apart as I try and pick it up. Now, what's cool about this, and I gotta remind you, you're eating this at your desk instead of that sandwich. You're eating this, if you're a driver for Uber or Lyft, you're eating this in the car because you cooked it with the 12-volt adapter instead of the drive-through. Right. Have you ever taken a second, especially if you're somebody that orders out a lot and just thinking about all of the processed food that's going into your diet, and the fact that you can do this and do it from fresh, or you can reheat up all of your, uh, you know, your own foods that you're bringing from home. And we're not just stopping with packaged foods. Have a look what I've done here. I've taken fresh tomato soup oh my gosh, that I had at in home. In a bowl. And it just a needs a flat bottom, it's right? Just a flat bottom, or the packaging that your fast food comes in. So here we go. We're going to take a couple of of, of uh, sliders that in yes. the microwave would normally be almost inedible. But look at this. Look the how cheese perfect that bread is, is melted. Too. It's steaming, it's beautifully warmed buns. Oh I mean, you're goodness. taking the most average dishes and turning them incredible. Yeah. So whether you're heating, whether you're reheating, whether it's for your leftovers, whether it's for the dish that you had last week that you wanna have at lunch again today, or if you're cooking from fresh, this is absolutely gonna do the job. And you can see all the different types of materials that can go in it as long as it's a flat bottom there. The reviews though, the feedback this on world. this, look at this, it's perfect. I've cooked veggies, kept meat moist, great for hot sandwiches. I used this for the first time at work. I plugged it around nine, put my frozen steak burger in it. By 11.30, it was cooked to perfection. I know a lot of people get this as a gift for those who are on the road a lot, truck drivers, salespeople, oh, police you, officers. You have to have this, listen. Anywhere I, you are with power. Right. right. I travel a lot in the summertime and I take my family with me. And I'm telling you, we use this in the vehicle so often, you can't even believe it. When you're traveling with a family of, of three or four, just a simple lunch turns into 40, 50, 60 bucks. And if yeah. you are gonna go ahead and go to some of these parties this year, have a look. That plate is removable, and so is the cord. I'm just gonna set it here. So if you're gonna do your favorite dips, your seven layer dips, any of your, uh, oh. uh, you know, all of your fun stuff for the holidays, go ahead and just take that plate out, and now you've got these warming. They're already nice and hot because you kept them hotter cooking on the way there. So and then once you get there, you can keep them warm. And here's the best part. The Hot Logic, the mini personal portable oven that you use to cook it in, go ahead and leave that guy as a gift. I love that. Wow, okay, so we have great colors to choose from. Some of them are already getting pretty limited here, so oh, I just sure. wanted to show you that we have pink, we have blue, there's 400 of the pink, by the way. We have blue, we have this beautiful red, I love that red color, black. This one is the green, and we have orange, and purple is in the front. It's $34.95 to get, what a great gift Absolutely this is, amazing. for sure. Five flexible payments as well on this one. We've seen all the multiple types of food you can make, the measurements, once again, it's nine and a half by seven and a half. Right. So uh, you've got all those types of size dishes at home already. You may have like the loaf pans we see here. If you're picking up the frozen cardboard box meals, right. those will fit inside oh, as long sure as it's flat. And then on your screen, we're showing you estimated cook times as well. Exactly. Have a look here, guys. And it all depends on whether it's fresh or frozen, whether you're dealing with uh, reheating or, 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 or heating thick foods or, uh, you know, dense or less dense foods. But pretty much everything you're going to look at fresh is going to be within 30 minutes to two 
two hours, mm -hmm. depending on how dense it is. And everything frozen, uh, about two to four. But now have a look at this. Are you a grill person? Instead of going to that uh, cookout where the grills are outside and birds are flying over them and you don't know what's been <laughs> cooking on them and all that kind of stuff, go ahead and create your own little like hot mm. dog cart. You know the big box stores with the little membership prices? Yeah. That's what they're doing there. Let's keep going here. How many can we get out in a couple of minutes here? I know. And then, that's that like speed good, around here. Way. For breakfast, Yum. check this out. Before you go to bed, crack a bunch of eggs in a cup or oh. do that overnight uh, oatmeal bit and just let it sit. And when you get up in the morning, this is great when you're it's camping. It's ready to go. Fresh and gorgeous. How about dessert? Here we go. Oh, that's not dessert. That's lasagna. Uh, that's dessert for me. <laughs> I love me some cheese and pasta. So let me goodness. show you this. I love this. You want to talk... Wow. The best pastas. And how about this? If you're a little late getting to dinner, this is ready for you. It's going to hold oh. that temperature, and it's never, ever, ever going to dry out. And so that could be from frozen. It could absolutely. be from fresh. It could be leftovers you're reheating. This will actually cook your food as well. And you don't have any dials or knobs. There's the dessert. This is right out of the freezer at the groceries. This is actually a cookie that you bake in the oven at home. But instead, in your hot logic, if you want a nice little dessert, go ahead and pop it in there. And while you're at your desk, while you're camping, while the kids are in class, whatever it is you're doing, this is actually going to cook it, bake it, and have it mm. hot, ready, steamy, and perfect. And all you need is an outlet. Can I ask you a question? Please. A couple people, in terms of the outlet, some are asking about if you want to use it in the car.